those that have questions for Coach Clifford, please raise your hand in the chat and we will get to you. Uh, first question goes to Dan Savage, OrlandoMagic.com. Cliff, after you know looking at the game, how did you feel about your team's purpose of play and uh, how the scrimmage went overall? Better in the second half. Um, you know, we started the game off pretty well. Uh, when we broke the lineup, uh, you know, the offense struggled. And then when the starters came back in that last five minutes, you know, they played well. And then I thought the second half was much better. We were more inside out. I know our defensive activity was better in the second half. And, uh, you know, so it's like anything. We'll watch the film. We'll see. And uh, we have two days of uh, hopefully good practice. And hopefully we'll play better uh, against the Lakers. Evan Fitzgerald, Fox 35. Hey, Coach, from a, from a conditioning standpoint, I know it was sort of up in the air what you'd actually see when you got out there against uh, another. Did you feel like overall how close the guys were to, to sort of being game ready? Yeah, it's, it's guy by guy. I mean, we have some guys who could, uh, you know, I think looking at it uh, are ready to take a step and play more minutes. And we have other guys who, you know, are not, are not you know, not nearly – where they need to be. So I think that would be every team. Um, and uh, again, you know, we still have, we have, you know, we have a ways to go obviously in that regard. Philip Rossman Reich, Orlando Magic Daily. Hey coach, obviously this, this game felt like a, a bit of an unknown just to kind of get a, get a sense of where everyone was. Was there, was there anything that surprised you or, or you didn't quite know to expect uh, that, that, that happened in this game? I don't know about surprise. I was disappointed. You know, the, the one thing that uh, we were doing well, um, you know, before the break, before play stoppage, was moving the ball and playing with, like, really good flow offensively. And they're terrific on defense and they're long. And their, de their denial and their switching um, slowed us down. So uh, that's why these teams, the three teams that we play in are obviously their elite teams. And and it's good because what you don't do well, uh, you find out, and that'll help us as we plan uh, in the next couple of days. Dan Savage, OrlandoMagic.com. Cliff, obviously, uh, Michael Carter Williams was playing really well before the stoppage. Uh, looked like he had a lot of aggressiveness tonight. What did you see from MCW? Yeah, he's played well. Uh, he's come back. I mean, he was one of the guys that was here and uh, was able to or took full advantage of the of the individual workouts that we did and he's practiced very well and he continued that tonight tim bonhams hey cliff i was just curious what your thoughts were on kind of the unique uh setup down there you know first you guys were kind of the first game played in this environment with no fans and kind of everything else what was your sense of it i, I told doc i thought it was uh you know much more comfortable than I thought it would be. Um, I think that the teams that can adapt to, you know, playing in a, in a unique kind of different environment without all the fans, whoever can uh, get the right mindset and, and so they can concentrate on just playing will have a big advantage. Uh, but uh, the NBA has done, I mean, an incredible job of the way they've organized everything, set it up to make it as comfortable as possible for the players. Josh Thanks, Robbins, The Athletic. Steve, obviously, you know, guys are going to need some time to get their legs stronger and under them. How much uh, do you think uh, conditioning and basketball shape played into long range shooting tonight? Uh, you know, I definitely think so. And just being in rhythm also, I think that I, I agree with you. I think a lot of it is just, you know, conditioning, getting your legs under you and then you know, it's the first time that they played against, an, a, you know, a different team, another opponent. Uh, so I think that had something to do with it also. Any other questions for Coach Clifford before we let him go? Going once. All right, thanks, Cliff. Thank you.